way up high in the sky, repeat says the sun was a coming up. Buster Jiggs with a trembling hand poured coffee in his cup. Says he to Sandy Bob, that whiskey that we drank was bad. Last night I dreamed the most peculiar dream I've ever had. I dreamed a rope the devil himself and necked him to a tree. Sawed his horns and sizzled his hide and you was a helping me. Well, Sandy Bob turned kind of pale and said, funny you should say. I remember last night's fun the same peculiar way. So they brought back up the road a piece and stars to look around. And sure enough, they find some cloven hoof prints on the ground. Well, Sandy Bob steps down to get his rope and lordy me. It's wrapped around that devil's hide and still tied to that tree. It will split right down from head to tail for the devil that left in haste. Got out of his skin at the break of day, split clean and left no waste. It was red as fire and hard as nails, had scales and don't you know? They rolled it up and they strapped it on where a bedroll ought to go. Says Bob, let's stop at the cobbler shop when we get into town. This hide would make some right fine boots, the kind that won't wear down. Use the back for soles and the belly for tops, and when most of the hide is gone, you can use them swallow forked old ears for tabs to pull them on. Well, the cobbler took a whole month's pay and a week to do the job. And when he was through, there was no one who had fire red boots like Bob. So he pulls them on, puts his pants inside, steps out in the sun. And when he hit that dusty street, his troubles were begun. Them devil boots danced up to Jigs and kicked him in the knee. Then two stepped across the street and lost old Bob right up a tree. Buster squalled like a leppy calf, has the devil got into you? And Sandy Bob stepped in the air and said, hey,